On March 3rd, 2019, Arden Mall had shut down due to anticipation of a protest happening, which did indeed occur. The protest was against the DA's decision on March 2nd to not file charges against the police officers involved in the shooting of Stefan Clark a year preceding. A day later, on March 4th, 2019, another protest down Freeport Boulevard had happened, which resulted in the arrest of 84 people. On March 7, 2019, a third protest on the decision for the charges on a police officer that shot Stefan Clark had walked to Sacramento. Join us, join us, join us. The protest march had started at Sac City College and ended at the Capitol. The marchers had visited schools in Sacramento calling for the students inside to join the march. At the peak of the march, there were around 500 people consisting of high school and college students. My name is Rose Magoda and I am the president of Black Student Union. Okay. So do you know any veterans in the club or have you been in the club long enough to where you were there last year when the shooting occurred at the Stephon Clark incident and what people were talking about then, what the club thought and uh, what people were saying? So I was a part of BSU Black Student Union for the past prior years of my high school experience, so for three years. And as of last year, I personally know our higher up officials, such as the president and vice president. And we had discussed the shooting. Um, overall, the consensus is it is a huge shame and it is unfortunate that that event happened, but it's become humanized and normalized to the point where we just internalized it. And overall, we believe that there could have been more action done. So uh, how do you, uh, as the president, and also how does the club overall feel about the decision uh, that came up just recently about not charging the officers? So overall, our overall consensus is that, one, the DA should have come up with a better decision. If not, then have persecuted the officers. And we also believe that not enough, like, not enough has been done and still won't be done. So we are just very ashamed of our system. And are there any other organizations that have been vocal about uh, the Stefan Clark incident that you thought ha had good points? So I personally did not look into other organizations or other movements that were set forth for this incident. Uh, I believe that just other organizations have responded better and have done a lot to just bring awareness and overall awareness. And I believe that just all their movements and all that they've done is a step in the right direction. And then, uh, what is your opinion on the demonstration in front of the Arden Mall Saturday? 
I feel as it could have taken place in a better community or just area in general because t protesting at a mall does leave you some impact, but I believe that it would have had a major impact if they had done it in a different location. And also because a lot of people might have just joined for the fun of it and not really for the serious, like the like the serious purpose of it. That's it. Um, and then, uh, have you heard anything about the protest last night? And uh, would you have anything to say about that? The um, and all of the arrests that occurred. So I am unaware of the protest that happened as of last night and where it took place. But with the arrest, knowing that it was like over forty people arrested. Um, I believe that that is completely like unnecessary to do that, and I believe that they're unlawfully arrested, especially since protesting is our First Amendment right. And I believe that the fact that they're arrested, they should be like, like they shouldn't have to face consequences in which what's unlawful because one, they were protesting, and it was peaceful. There is no violence or just like any abrupt demonstrations. I don't really know how to describe it, right. but yeah, that's it. Okay. Thank you. Welcome. Uh, hi, Mr. Lambert. Yeah, um, we're with the, the newspaper. Okay. We were just uh, wondering um, like what's going on with this. Is there like a protest happening, you heard? Uh, from Sac City College. They uh, walked down and they protested. Okay. Uh, do we know what it's about yet, or no? Apparently it's about the Stefan Clark decision. Okay. Um, should students be concerned or no? Um, well, I think if students have a passion about it, I think students should always be concerned about issues and things that are going on within our city and okay. um, within our society. So students should definitely be involved and concerned. Mm -hmm. um, I mean, yeah, obviously about the issue. I was wondering about the um, the protest that was happening. Should people be concerned about that happening so close to the school? Um, the protesters are just exercising their their rights as citizens to voice their opinions. So I think that as citizens, they have that right. Thank you very much for your time. <laughs> Absolutely.